What's going on everyone? My name is Udalito and today we have a brand new video on my channel where I'm finally back. I've been on a small vacation now for two months. I also miss sick. Uh, I got Grandula fever, I think it was three to four weeks ago now. And I was actually pretty sick, you know. I went to the hospital, didn't feel great at all. But the most important thing now is that I'm suddenly doing better each day by day, you know. And um, in this video we will be opening our first packs for FIFA 21 And I just want to say before this video starts It is um, is it going to be I'm um, opening for FIFA points Which is real money that you need to put into the game And if you are not having that money You shouldn't be putting your money on FIFA points I, I, I just want to say that you know Because I need to do this Because I'm a professional FIFA player I want to have the best advantages to qualify etc And this game is unfortunately pay to win uh, Now as it is um, So I'm telling you once again I'm doing this as my job And don't spend your money on FIFA points If you're not having the money That's what I want to say And I just want to know in the comments down below, should I create a Swedish channel as well? Because this is my main English channel now and I want to create Swedish content as well. So comment down below if you think I should start a Swedish channel as well in the comments. And the announcement. Before jumping into vi to the video, me, my friend, my best friend Adam and one of my best friends in Dejex, William Berg, is going to have a 24 hour stream now on Tuesday. It uh, starts 4 o'clock, 3 p.m. UK time, I think. 4 o'clock Swedish time. It's going to be starting this Tuesday when FIFA drops. Um, so please check in the stream by uh, stream then. It's going to be live from the MIP headquarters up in Stockholm. So uh, there is going to be tons of giveaways, FIFA points given out, uh, FIFA codes, FIFA 21 codes uh, given out to get the full game. So. Hopefully, I'll see you then. Let's jump into the video and hopefully we can pack something great. Okay. German. Goalie. And that's an inform, at least. Um, by now, I don't know how to see if it's a board, rare player, non-rare player, walkout, etc. So, uh, yeah. I, I need to learn that sort of stuff. But, I mean, an inform in our, I think, fifth pack. I think it was, at least. Decent, uh, definitely. So yeah, we are still opening. Okay, Portugal, goalie. That is Lopez, right? Eighty-five rated, eighty-three rated. He has been downgraded a lot, though. I mean, I think he was eighty-five last game on FIFA twenty. But I mean, still a decent goalie. Definitely will be sending him to the transfer pile. Just discarding this stuff. Okay, Brazil, CDM. Not a walkout, unfortunately. Fernando, 83 rated. Decent player, of course, but a bit slow. Um, definitely decent. Ooh. That was probably one of the best ones, boys. We actually got Quadrado. Should be a bit. Like 5k at least. 5.5 I think he is. That's definitely decent. Okay, finally, Portugal, left mid, Benfica, and that is going to be Rafa, 94 pace, 87 dribbling. I mean, I haven't packed a walkout yet, and I mean, I think I opened for around 9k points now, and I got like, maybe 5 to 6 borders, which is definitely good enough. Okay, Germany, goalie again, same goalie, right? Trap, 83 rated, not the best, but at least a border. Okay, Dutch, CM. Vijnaldum. That is good. That is definitely great, man. 85 Vijnaldum is definitely the best thing we packed. At least now. 85 rated Vijnaldum. I'm very, very happy with that. Let's see on footprint how much he is. Uh, Vijnaldum. Should be around like 30k. Even more, I think. 22 at least. Uh, his price range is a bit tricky now because I think he's worth more than 25k. So of course I will be saving him. Discarding these types of players, then discarding these. And then saving actually Vijnaldum, which is a great pull. Let's go. Okay. Back to back. Spain, Villarreal. Gerard Moreno shouldn't be much. Shouldn't be much. 83 rated. At least a board. A back to back board is definitely something. He has a, a, a pretty interesting price range, 35k. Huh. 
Okay, at least. He shouldn't be worth a lot, so selling him for a bit more than that, than discarding rests. Boys, we are... It's, it's getting better, at least. Definitely. Portugal. Goalie again, man. Lopez again. I mean, when... I don't know if it's a border or a walkout. I'm sorry to hype up, because... I can't pack CR7. The chances of that happening isn't that high, but I mean, it's still Portugal. Uh, Lopez just selling him. Okay, Mania? Mm. Okay, inform. Decent. Samaseku? I thought I was about to get Mania, you know? But I mean, an inform is definitely decent. 10k, taking that every day of the week. Okay, Switzerland, goal is summer. Birki, 84 rated goalie from Dortmund, decent. Okay, Argentina striker. And I'm getting, of course I'm getting Higuain. I could have gotten Aguirre, you know. Okay. Again, center back. Mati. Right, 83 Mati, definitely decent. I mean, he could go for a bit of coins, maybe like 2k, I, I say, because he's from Liverpool and 83 rated. Says 3.9 on foot pain button blisting after 3.4. Decent. And now, boys, we are halfway into the um, pack opening. Uh, into the video, of course. We've been packing Vignaldum, which you saw. Which was a great um, great pull. We, we actually packed by Arabi before. Um, like 5 to 6k at least for him. And now we are at the halfway and we haven't packed anything like special at all. Vignaldum is decent of course, but of course I want a walkout. I haven't packed a walkout yet, which we are just waiting for I guess. So hopefully we can get something good jumping into the next 15k now. Okay, Croatia, CM. Kovacic. Of course I thought of Modric, but I can't complain. 83 Kovacic is actually decent. 75 pace, 87 dribbling is definitely something I can use in my starter team. But uh, yeah, we will be sending in through the transfer pile. Decent, decent pool. Okay. Can this be something? German center back. Inform. Definitely decent. I mean, Udukai. Looks decent. Inform, I'm taking it every day of the week. Milan, Donnarumma, right? 85 rated Donnarumma, though. 85 rated. I thought he was about to be maybe 82 or 83 Donnarumma. Decent pull, definitely. We'll be selling him, though. Ooh. I didn't even pay attention because I'm eating at the same time, but Adama Traore. He should be worth a lot, actually. I mean, not a lot, but some coins. I mean, 11k. I'm taking that every day of the week. That's probably the second best player I packed. Definitely. Decent pull. Germany center back again. And it's that same inform game again. 20... No, not 20k. 10k. I'm taking that every day of the week. Once again. I mean, 10k for a 7.5k pack is pretty decent, I guess. But we haven't packed a walkout yet. And we opened about, I think, 20k points. So, yeah. I'm still waiting here. I'm waiting. I think that is a great pull. As I said, I'm eating at the same time. But Richarlison is worth 16k. He's even more now. I'm saving him, you know. I'm definitely saving him. Discard needs to. I mean, that that's a great pull. Definitely. It says on footprint that is 16, but he was bidded on for 22. So, I'm definitely saving him. Brazil. Striker. Jesus. That's decent. 83 rated Jesus, I'm definitely taking. I think that's definitely a great player to get, you know. I think he should be at least 20k at the start now. At least, so. That's a great pull. Let's go. Okay, back to back. Pandanovic. First walkout. This year. For NIP Ulelito. Is Handanovic, 88 rated, not the best of, of walkouts, but I'm taking it every day of the week. 88 Handanovic is my first walkout this year. Um, definitely happy with that, to be honest. Uh, thought I could be getting, I mean, I think I'm open for around like 25k now. Which could have been a bit better, but, but it could have been a lot worse as well. I'm taking that every day of the week and we're jumping into 
the last 7k, I think it is. Ooh, that is actually a great pull. Klosterman, 84 pace. And he should be worth more than 10k in my opinion. We could check more than 10k. I mean, he's extinct at 10k. We'll be going for more than 10k at the start. So we'll be sending him to the transfer pad and just waiting for him to go up in price a bit. That is class. Okay, Dutch. See him again. Vijnaldum again, right? Vinaldum 85, I'm taking that. Let's go. I think he will be worth around at least 50 to 60k when the market has risen a bit. The market is pretty low now, but it's getting higher and higher at the moment. That's definitely decent. I'm taking that every day of the week. Vinaldum 85, been packing him two times now. Okay. CM, who can this be? Partey, right? Thomas Partey? Decent, definitely decent. 84 rated should be around like maybe 5k at least. No? Yes, actually 9k. A bit more. Yeah. Around 9k, which I think is definitely decent. We'll take that every day of the week. And last pack. For this pack opening, it's going to be Van Aken. I think I packed in like five times now, Van Aken. Thank you though for watching this video, I appreciate it a lot. I'm back boys, back on YouTube, we'll be grinding YouTube full time now. I'm thinking about creating a Swedish channel though, because this is actually my main uh, English channel, but I know there are a lot of fans that want to see me talk English. So yeah, if you think I should do a Swedish YouTube channel as well, write it in the comment section down below. And uh, yeah. Don't miss Tuesday, because that is going to be a hell of a lot of fun. As I said, 4 o'clock, me, Derdix and Adam is um, opening a lot of packs. Just having fun, 24 hours straight. And we'll see you there. See you, boys. Peace.